Kule dia. Good morning. My name is Dr. Tred Rissacker, and I'm here today to represent the Slim Body Laser Spa Health and Wellness Center. And uh, we're using a non-invasive FDA cleared laser device to help people to lose weight when weight is very difficult to lose. If you have stubborn, persistent body fat or you're struggling to, uh, to, to get the scale going in another direction, or maybe you've had uh, the COVID, COVID-15, they call it, the, the weight gain. Uh, average is 15 pounds, by the way, across uh, most people that were surveyed with, since COVID have lost, uh, have gained over 15 pounds, if you could believe that. Let me bring that in a little bit. <laughs> I like to. Okay, so we're a little out of focus there. Hang on a second. <laughs> there we go. I like that. So it's called the COVID-15. And uh, at my laser spa, I'm located on East Ocean Boulevard, right across the street from the Fresh Market uh, at the intersection of Monterey Road and East Ocean Boulevard. And you can lose three to nine inches literally while you lie on your back and listen to music. It's really that amazing. Uh, we've been doing it now for, uh, I have a three inch loss results guaranteed in writing. So if you come into the spa and you sign up for a plan, part of my commitment to you is that you are a good candidate and that I believe the laser, of course, uh, will guarantee to lose inches. And I put that in writing, and we've been doing that for 10 years. Over 5,000 people all have had that guarantee. Rarely do we miss the mark because it's a guarantee. I want to make sure you get the results. Uh, another factor about our office is we are number one in our market. For over 10 years, we've been number one uh, in laser body sculpting and slimming results. And I'm going to go over a lot today about who's a good candidate and uh, what you can look for in body sculpting. It's a pretty popular new genre that a lot of people are looking at. And I, I believe I want to clarify some of the, the facts and the myths from this non-invasive body sculpting. Today's going to be all about body sculpting. My process is uniquely developed by me. Yeah, Dr. Tread. It, it's, my, it's my dream, it's my creation, it's my uh, effort that went into this. It was enormously, uh, it just happened. I like to say it truly happened. Uh, at our office, we are combining uh, stubborn spot fat reduction, such as someone that would be interested in liposuction or cool sculpting, and skin tightening along with traditional weight loss at the same time. Now that's rare. Most offices either deal with the outer fat, body sculpting, tummy tucks, chin tightening, a little bit of flab on the thighs, or you go in for weight loss, traditional weight loss, and they can't guarantee any changes to, your, uh, to the outer fat because that's not what weight loss does. I saw that as a weak point for both offices, for both clinics, whether you're into spot fat reduction only and somebody comes in and they have uh, food problems and they're overeating and they're not taking, you know, there's issues with weight, they're not a good candidate for spot fat reduction, really, because they are dealing with too much weight. However, if you go to the weight loss center and uh, because you've gained too much weight, you've got a lot of outside fat, sometimes voluminous, voluminous, voluminous amounts. That means lots. And weight loss really isn't going to change the outer fat once you get to a certain age. So having a process which can handle the outer layers along with the weight loss it's, it's just super more effective. And it's, it's a specialty that we offer at Slim Body that nobody else is really able to do because their procedures, their spot fat procedures are damaging. They're, they can injure tissue. There's a healing process after you heat it, freeze it, suck it, burn it, you know, ultrasound it you know, shock it with electrical waves, this new EMS machine that uses high pulsed energy, magnetic energy, which I'm gonna talk about today. Uh, our process is uses a low level laser. 
And the low-level laser is uh, a device which is low-level, meaning it doesn't create any heat or damage. And what it does is it actually causes the fatty, the, the, the fat cells that are located in the subcutaneous compartment, the difficult area to reach uh, with diet and exercise. This laser releases those calories, and then they're consumed and absorbed by the lymphatic system by the natural body's ability to heal it to clean itself which is the lymphatic system and then you burn it as energy during that day every time you do the process put the laser on something at our office you lose an inch quarter inch a half inch an eighth of an inch and then you combine that with three measurements you had an inch and a half you do that nine times in three weeks you can lose six to nine inches and at the same time, we're helping you with nutrition. We are sitting down and I personally am taking the time to teach you about your nutrition and what you need to do to, uh, to keep the weight off, to get better results from the laser. I think all that's really critically important. And uh, why should you pay extra for that when you're already paying for the laser so there's no extra charge for any of the nutritional help you get? And, and another thing I think is really important, very unique to our process, is I'm not there to sell you a lot of supplements, injections, meetings to attend, uh, home delivery food services, you know. Weight loss centers all have a gimmick, something they have to sell in order to, uh, to make a buck. And typically, uh, you know, because to sit down with someone and teach them what to eat and what to buy and, and how to, you know, about food, there's, there's just no money in that for weight loss centers. The money in the weight loss center is the supplements that are required for you to be in the program or the fact that you're going to buy pre-shipped food, auto-shipped food, such as from Jenny Craig or Nutrisystem. Now, Weight Watchers used to be one of the only weight loss programs that did not sell you a lot of products. Uh, they had uh, meetings, which I think are wonderful because you get support from each other. And uh, they, have a, uh, they, they, they work up the nutritional education in what they call points. So, you know, proteins and simple carbs and complex carbs, they all have a point system. So instead of trying to count calories, which is what you're really doing, you just call it points, uh, the amount of protein points and the amount of carbohydrate points, once you reach your max, you have to, uh, you can't eat any more points. Now, the other part is, if you don't reach your max, you can actually have extra points the next day, which is really traditional weight loss. You know, knowing your caloric intake, your BMR, understanding the caloric the calories you're eating, how many calories you're eating, spacing it out through the day, and if you eat a little less in that day, you actually can eat those extra calories the next day. At the same time, if you overeat your calories or your points, the next day you have to eat less points. Weight Watchers started that phenomena, that fad. But if you go to Weight Watchers today, they still have the meetings. But it's filled with, uh, with, with processed foods, things you can buy, you know, meal plans, uh, different sippy drinks, appetite. I don't want to say appetite suppressants. I don't know all their products. But I do know when I, when I look in, they wouldn't let me in, by the way. Uh, I looked in the window and I could see they have racks of, uh, of protein bars and shake mixes and things that are very, un, you know, not what Weight Watchers used to be. However, uh, as they say, uh, any port in storm, if you're a sailor, any, any port in storm is better than suffering. And uh, I'm not critical of, of any of these weight loss programs because they do help you to lose weight. Uh, I just believe that uh, I'm just giving you the, the, the facts about these different programs so you can make an informed decision. You know, it's, you have to look at long term. All of these processes, weight loss centers, all lose weight very quickly. I mean, that's proven. Where they really fail is in keeping the weight off, and I think everybody knows that. All right, so uh, you're listening to Dr. Tred Rissacker. If you've just tuned in, uh, I've got already 20 minutes into this. Uh, I haven't even given my phone number. My phone number is 772-223-5885, and I'm located on East Ocean Boulevard across the street from the Fresh Market. Uh, we offer laser lipo plans. 
They're three week plans. They're nine laser sessions in three weeks. It includes the use of whole body vibration machines after the laser. You stand on a whole body vibration plate for 10 minutes. Basically it shakes you up, gets the circulation going. Uh, they're not dangerous. We use them, people in the 90s use them, people with hip replacements, knee replacements, bad backs. All of them can use whole body vibration. You just have to use it properly and, and we supervise that. And then at the same time, you're given some supplements which are included, you don't have to pay extra. Uh, they're very simple. They're called Herbal Detox 2 and they're made by a company called Wonder Labs and basically they are well proven herbs it's like six different herbs in that capsule. You have one in the morning and one in the evening. And there's a definite fact that toxins are stored in your fatty tissue. So toxins that you breathe in from petroleum, from exhaust, uh, uh, toxins that you get from the plastics, from the, the, uh, the, the cosmetics you put on your body, from the sprays you put on, to the fragrances you smell, to the clothing you wear, which is no longer natural, they're all petroleum products. These toxins leach. They travel into your bloodstream through the skin and through the breath, and there's no mechanism really for the body to get rid of them very efficiently. So as you accumulate these certain classifications of toxins, which are fat soluble, they, you can't rinse them with water, they're stored in your fatty tissue. So the safest area of fat to store them is the fat that lines the outside of the body. If, your body, if you were to store those toxins in your inner fat around your organs, that would not be a good idea when you have the outer fat available. Now, of course, you really get poisoned. You, know, you have a lot of toxins, heavy body burden, they call it. It goes in both compartments, but for the most part, it's very much populated in the outer fatty layer. So, you know, this is causative. This is the etiology. This is one of the reasons why you have stubborn fat on the outside of the body. It is a direct relationship to the amount of toxins that you might have or could have been exposed to in your life. And as those toxins were stored away in your outer fatty layer, the body will crave food and crave things to make fat and fill up that compartment to protect you from those toxins. Now, it would be great if, they were, if you were truly protected, but all they do is they kind of keep them under the surface. And over time, as you age, you accumulate toxins. It's an accumulative disorder. You get more and more and more and more in little bits. So you don't realize you're being toxically poisoned. And then, you know, we start having symptoms. We start having symptoms from toxic exposure. And, and some people might, it might manifest as allergies. It could manifest as chronic sinusitis, chronic, you know, sore throats or uh, breathing issues, fluid, because, you know, the, the body's poison release system is the breath and sinuses and mucus and, and the skin. They might show up as skin rashes, skin lesions. Uh, it, it's also described uh, one of the big poisons and toxins which people are more educated about are, is mold, the black mold, right, the fungus. The, uh, these types of molds that are prevailing in our air conditioning systems and in our houses if they get wet, like if things get wet and you get this black toxic mold. And the reason why you're aware of it is there's a huge uh, business to remove mold and to uh, put lawsuits against people that get exposed to mold. And, uh, but it's all just a poisoning. It's a toxin which is now in your system, most likely stored in your fatty tissue. And when you start to want to look better and to feel better by losing weight, you've decreased that toxic protective layer goes down. And now those toxins are no longer protected or some of them aren't, and they go into the system. And when toxins are released, 
just like any poison, you might have some sweats, you might feel uh, nauseous, you might have difficulty cognitively thinking, keeping clear thoughts. At night when you go to sleep, you might have night sweats, wake up drenched in your sheets, and you're like, my God, what's going on? You know, just that's what poisons do to people. They make you detox. It's called detoxification. And I'm mentioning this because a lot of you out there, which is because we live in, a, in an industrial world where we cannot avoid all the poisons, uh, we're all being having these little hits, these little toxic exposures. Some have more than others. I was doing a consultation on a, a really nice guy my age, and uh, he had stubborn, persistent belly fat. He was 52 years old, and uh, and he's like, I am like really, I'm a healthy person, he said. He goes, I scuba dive, I exercise, I practice, uh, you know, I'm, I'm on a plant-based diet with only lean proteins, I take vitamins, and six years ago, I became very, very ill, and uh, they, they don't know what's wrong with me. I've ended up with allergic reactions and skin rashes. I ended up with bowel uh, infections in his, in his colon, like diverticulitis and, and uh, difficulty absorbing proteins, which is really systemic inner gut problems, and, and they thought I had cancer, and uh, I don't know, I'm living with this, but I'm here because I want to get rid of this outer fatty layer that's accumulated since this happened, he told me. <clears throat> so I asked him, can you tell me a little about your past? You know, your job, your work, what, what did you do? He says, well, I'm, I'm an engineer. I'm basically, he was, he's a materials engineer, and that means paint, paints. This guy worked at All Grip, which is the company, you know, one of the big, um, chemical companies that make the paints for the boats. His job was to, to synthesize and to deal with paints and thinners and colors and marine applications and area aircraft applications. In other words, every day he went into work, he smelled paint <laughs> in the form of fumes. And 25 years of, of working in this industry around spray painting and, and sanding and then just to deal with those chemicals, he started to get sick. And none of the doctors ever pointed out or looked at his past as to why this could, that it was maybe come from poisoning because it's happened so slowly. And when you check his blood work, is good, you know, his hormones are good, the MRIs are negative, the x-rays are negative, but his symptoms are out of this, out of, are crazy. So, as I told him, and I didn't know he had this exposure, so as I went into my, uh, my talk about what, what to expect at the spa, because he was thinking of doing it, and then I mentioned the detox. And I told him about the toxins living in the fatty tissue, and it's usually because you're exposed to petroleum products. And his eyes opened up, his mouth dropped, and he said, that's it, that's gotta be it. Um, I, and then he told me his past as, a, as an engineer with, with paints. So, to needless to say, he signed up for a three-month program. My program's only three weeks. But when he looked at the amount of time he had and how much exposure he probably felt he had, he realized it was going to take longer than three weeks. So I did, a, I did the normal three-week program, and then I did an extra month. I did extra two months uh, at a discount, because that's what we do even if you finish the program. But I wanted him to commit to the whole plan, and I was a little bit more uh, on top of getting him to start eating foods that help with detoxification. So the, the foods that occur in the, in the planet, the herbs and the vegetables and the, uh, the fresh fruits, these are cleansing foods. <laughs> they are eliminative foods. The vegetable kingdom and the fruit are put on earth to give you enzymes, minerals, phytonutrients, bioflavonoids, all of these, the colors of the fruit, there's a lot of water base to them. If you eat vegetables, have a lot of water in them, you're getting, your, your body starts to flush out. Apples, apple juice, melons, excellent flushing foods. They eliminate toxins. So his diet 
was not perfect, but he liked his pizzas, he liked his pastas, he has an Italian background, and uh, there were certain vegetables he didn't like at all, even though he felt he was on a plant-based diet, but what I found out, he was really on an organic diet, which had a lot of carbohydrates. And uh, so my recommendation was, you know, you need to do some water fasting where you, you drink a lot of water to get the system to start flushing out. And then I want you to start eating more vegetables and fruit that have a high water content, a lot of water in it. And of course, the laser to help release the toxins from that outer layer. The laser opens up the fat cells. It also improves the circulation in the outer compartment, that subcutaneous which is where those poisons are stored. And then he went through a process of uh, you know, taking the detox supplements, which are herbs which bind with poisons to form a water-soluble po compound so you can just pee them out. So what, what you couldn't release through the bladder, you can release with the herbs connected to them. It's called chelation. And as you release those, your poison levels come down. You're literally slowly cleansing the body. Well, in three months, 80% of his symptoms went away. His belly fat was gone in like four weeks. But the next two months was just a process of him feeling stronger, healthier, more flexibility, less symptoms at night. I mean, his, his mind was able to think clearer. It was so many things that were happened to him that were beneficial. It was just too many to, to really number. Uh, I do talk to him today. He only finished that three month program and he learned so much from what we went over and he understood why he had had this, how to get rid of these toxins. And it's, it's a lifelong mission. You don't do it in one month or in three months. It's something you have to do again and again. You know, I detoxify regularly uh, and yet very few people do. And, uh, you know, their, their main way they do when they feel bad is, is they take more pills. They take something to feel better, and that just increases the toxin, the burden. All right. Uh, we're going to come back from a break here, and then I'm going to go over a little bit about uh, what you need to know about body sculpting and these non-invasive procedures that could save your life or at least save you some money because a lot of them don't work. So we'll be back in one moment. Thank you. Thank you.